Hey guys, in this video I'll be showing you how to make a basic anti-cheat for your Roblox game. First thing you want to do is come over to Starter Player, open this, click this plus in the Starter Character Scripts, and add a local script. Rename this to anti-cheat, and write what I do. This wait one is how often we will check the player for cheats, so you can adjust this to whatever. Just make sure it's greater than zero, or else it'll crash studio. So I'm going to run through this code real quick. This local humanoid just tells us that we can reference it using the word hum. This is just like shorthand for humanoid without having to write all this code. What this will do is every one second, it will run through these lines of code. So what this is going to do is it'll check if the humanoid walk speed is equal to 16, because this means not. This little symbol means not. So if it's not 16, it'll kick them and it'll give them the reason of speed x. What this will do is the same thing as the walk speed, but it'll do it for the jump power, which is default 50, and it'll give them the reason of jump hacks. So we can close this code and press play. Now you can see we can play the game, walk around, spend more than one second. Now if we go up here, open our player, go to the humanoid, and adjust the jump power to 55. You can see it kicks us for jump hacks, and we can't rejoin, we have to leave. Now if we play it again and we go this time to go change our walk speed, by going in here, going here, scrolling down to walk speed and changing it to 20. It'll kick us for speed hacks. Now if we want, we can also add these, like our max health is usually 100. So if I go in here and I add a new line and just say, if hume.max health isn't 100, then we could just copy this line, paste it in and say health hacks. Then we can close this, press play, open this, open this. Go to our humanoid, go to our max health, and change it to 155, we'll get kicked for health hacks. That's all I had to cover in this video, so if you liked it, make sure to like and subscribe. And yeah, thanks for watching, I'll see you in the next one.